Okay, I'm uncomfortable right now. And I'd like to, I'd like to leave. Hey guys, I'm Captain Spanx. We're playing Metro Exodus the 2033? What am I playing? Uh, this is a game, a series that I've never played before. Uh, it's like a, uh, from what I understand, let's do right, normal? It's a uh, kind of a, a shooter, post-apocalyptic, dark, Fallout-esque shooter, where I think ammo scarcity is a thing. Um, I don't really know much about this series. Never really grabbed my attention for some reason, but this is free on Game Pass. I still remember life before the war. Turn it up. I remember that we used to be different. Used to live up there, on the surface. We used to be the masters of the whole world. We built gigantic cities of glass and steel. We crossed the oceans at will. And we also conquered the skies. Okay, I guess it's Russia. <clears throat> there used to be seven billion of us. We were not born for life in the tunnels. I was born to breathe fresh air, and I remember it. Okay, we're on, on a train in Russia. Perhaps the tr Siberian Trans... Railroad? It's <laughs> good music. <clears throat> it's like a movie trailer music. Pandemonium. <clears throat> Chaos ensues. I'm guessing nuclear war precipitated all this? That's usually the case. The seven billion were wiped out by the last war. The last war. Only 50,000 managed to survive underground. There's never a last the war. poisoned, burned, and teeming with horrible monsters. World War One was supposed to be the war to end all wars. One day, the radiation on the surface might subside. And our grandchildren, or their grandchildren, might be able to return there. Radiation, yeah, I At think nukes. That's what my brothers in arms from the Order believe. Basically, there was no hope for us right off the start. Still, we humans are just too bad at surrendering. We humans. We tried to make the best of what we had. We humans often Bandit say the together. phrase, we humans. We worked to make the Metro our new home. I'm not gonna skip. After all, it might well be the only place left on Earth okay. for humans to live. So we're living underground, it looks like, because of the radiation. Time, <coughs> Whoa, is that a brothel? Make it. Red but, Light District? Regrettably, the war didn't kill our bad habits. I mean, you gotta have fun. Okay. It's a cool little intro. In the relative safety of the tunnels, corruption festered. And when danger came from above the ground, only a few of us stood against it, our numbers dwindling by the day. Oh, those aren't good looking animals. Radiation, you know what I'm saying? But I remember we were born for a better life. And I can't accept that I'm destined to grow old and die underground. Uh, you could I die above ground. Cold and idiot. Young. But if even a single shard of the old world still exists out there, I have to find it. Okay. <clears throat> so. We're traveling on a train, we're going through underground and then above Between ground. endless years of hopeless existence and even a single moment of hope, I must choose hope. Keep hope alive. I must find that signal. Oh, my first mission. <clears throat> a beacon. A distress signal, perhaps. Or it's a trap. It's a trap. Alright. So let's see what we got here. That was a little bit of an intro. In Russia. This looks like a... It was a pretty big city, at least. Perhaps Moscow, St. Petersburg. Mm -hmm. 
Now, I don't know how much of an open world this is, if at all, or if it's, like, zoned. <clears throat> uh, we're, oh, this is a blind playthrough. I always do my blind playthroughs. There's probably only going to be one episode, by the way, unless I really end up liking the game. I figure it's free on Game Pass. Let me try it. Classic radiation sound. <laughs> Careful, you won't want to slip. That would be the worst way to die, is here of starting off your adventure. Okay. Did he just slip for real? <clears throat> I told you to be careful, bro. Oh. I like the uh, frost on my HUD. I assume I'm wearing goggles. Oh, look at that breath. See that breath? On the bottom of the screen. Also, I, I like the meters, almost Dead Space-esque on his arm. I assume that's like bullets. That's weird. Why'd you do that? Okay, we don't, oh, 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 this is only two. Oh, ten! Timer's kicking down. Go! 102, never mind. Flashlight. Okay. Aha! <clears throat> we got a little HUD thing down the bottom left. Health. Timer. Damn, dude. You had a bad day. I like the atmosphere. <clears throat> I like the atmosphere. Hold LB, open equipment menu, and use your lighter on the web. What web? Did I just walk through it? <sighs> Any secrets? Oh my god! <clears throat> oh my god! Is it on me? Ugh, I don't like spiders, dude. What did that accomplish besides freaking me out, man? Okay, we got a melee. Jump. We have a crouch, but not a slide maneuver, it looks like. What is that? Alright. I can barely see these webs, dude. <clears throat> Like, seriously. And now I'm lost. Put, put your lighter away. Okay. I'm already lost. I just started this game. I'm so directionally challenged. Here we go. <clears throat> Destroy the webs. So, I came from this way, <clears throat> uh, I originally turned left, and then I turned right. I don't know what's happening. Do I turn the crank, maybe? Uh, those cranks look unturnable. Well, what the hell, dude? <clears throat> is this like it? Is this an episode already? I don't know where to go. Oh, here we go. <clears throat> yes. What's this? Repair? I like the look of the gun, by the way. It's kind of steampunky a little bit, I feel like. Not too much, but... I hear footsteps. Uh... I hear noises. Is that a cobweb? Okay, I just reloaded. We're in a cobweb. <clears throat> yes. Cobwebs. I see this. They slow me down. Okay. 
I'm uncomfortable right now. And I'd like to, I'd like to leave. I'm just, I'm just gonna leave now. Uh, I'd, I'd like to go. I do like the atmosphere going on here. Hello. Stuck in these webs. Get. Whoa! Get. Punch it. I don't know what you are. Shoot it. Yeah, I did that. <clears throat> the hell was that, man? Also, get rid of this freaking web. It's really starting to annoy me now. Where is it? Sheesh. Oh, jeez. You dead? Yeah. I got somebody's got a chair right here. Who would want to lounge right here? Look at this guy. He tried to escape. Oh, man. And, and that creature's gnawed off his legs. Just... Oh, okay. They kind of look like creatures from Doom or something. Oh, I took off my mask. Don't do that, dude. Oh, he wiped it off. You can wipe your mask. Interesting. Whoa. Oh, jeez. Put away your lighter, dude. Is that a headshot? Uh. Uh. What? Am I not hitting him? It was like green, indicating that I don't think I was hitting him, but... Okay. I haven't tried holding the button down. I don't know if this is automatic, but I'm trying to save my ammo because... I think... Also, I got some red on me. <clears throat> on my upper left. I think this is a game where it's uh, ammo th scar scarcity is, is real. Oh. Is that a glitch or a purpose? I think it's purpose. Huh? Are you flanking me, bro? Don't do it. Oh, check this out. Turret section. Give me. I want it. Oh, come on. What a tease. <laughs> reload, dude. Do I not have reload bullets? I don't think I do. Shoot. What am I stuck on? Go. Just run. I feel like I'm seeing more red at the top of the screen. Uh oh. Punch it. Yeah. Ooh, knife. Ooh, right the eyeball. How do I use my knife? No. Where are those supposed to be? They're like bald werewolves almost. Somebody help me, please. I'm kind of, kind of uh, busy. Look, he's got the knife stuck in his throat. I'm holding, bro. I'm holding. I can't really go anywhere. Ah. There was an interesting setting, by the way, in the settings that said you could turn off tinnitus sounds. I don't think I've ever seen that before. And I think that last sound was a tinnitus sound. It's night time at the station. Don't worry. How do you know it's nighttime? Okay. <clears throat> They're dragging me.
Let's cross the square. Do you think the colonel knows what Artyom been up to here? My controller's vibrating. I, I like the tone, the music. Hey, you, leave him alone. I feel like the voices are mixed a little low. Let him learn to stand up for himself. How else can he hope to survive in the metro? Rise and shine, people! Hang in there, Artyom. You're gonna get a fresh dose of Spartan blood now. Okay, cool. Well, that was uh, creepy. I didn't know this game was kind of like a horror game. I guess it, it is. <laughs> kind of into it. Let's we get past this tutorial section. Oh, Tim, are you awake? It's okay. The doctor said you'll be fine. Are you trying to kill me with worry? What if next time you don't return from the surface? There is okay. no one out there, Artyom. No one to find, no one to talk to. That was my jaw. If there was, don't you think they'd be here already? We've talked about this again and again. You have to accept it. There's only us. We don't know that. Look at that guy's legs. He's got uh, robot legs. All right. Hello, Miller. He looks like a badass, by the way. <clears throat> I don't care if you kill yourself over this silly dream of yours. But don't you see what you're doing to my daughter? Your wife? Dad, please. Turn this up a little. The order is short on men after the battle for D6. But you leave. People need you. And you pursue your selfish obsession. But now this shit has to stop. There's only Metro, nothing else. And the Order is here to defend it. Because if not us, then who? Mm hmm. Okay. That is only you look Metro. fine to me. So get ready to go. Get ready to go. Then da. we'll discuss your transfer to police. We'll discuss your transfer to police. Okay. Come, we need to talk. Any vodka? The doctor. Artyom, please promise me this was the last time. I'll see you later. I promise nothing. Give me some of that sweet Russian blood. <clears throat> Artyom, we managed to bring you back from the brink, but people are giving you their blood, which His could save so many wounded, and you keep bringing it back irradiated. Don't you hmm. think that is unfair? That's a good point, doctor. Let me put it this way. I can't promise I'll be able to bring you back next time. Okay. Well, thank you, Doctor, for that sweet, sweet Russian blood. Can I take any of your tools? No. Okay. I'm walking real slow. Walking real slow. Look at this thing. They spend so much time on the surface. What is that? It's like a Ferris wheel model? No, it's uh, what do you call those things? Artyom, I don't know. Just oh. try to take better care of yourself, huh? <laughs> Even if you find someone else out there, they probably have their own troubles. Mm hmm, okay. This is my run speed. What's going on over here, folks? Oh, got the bar. Where's the oh, vodka at? I can't believe my eyes. Artyom, you're all right. You gave you us a stick, brother. Artyom, how are you, friend? I see you all right. Gentlemen, give this way. calls for a celebration. Even at the bar, everyone's all geared up. Battle. Be completely irresistible to any woman. Speaking of which, Alyosha, how you are you so now, guys? Huh? Could you just stop crowding him? <sighs> High fives. Uh, uh, Alright, you're all this. I give you two hours, people. Let's go, boys. Yeah. And ladies, let's drink. I knew it. You guys are like so kids. I brought something. And here we go again. <laughs> Please, let's not repeat the last Hold time. on, Artyom. I'm holding. Everyone keeps telling me to hold on. I'm holding. I'm waiting for that Russian blood and vodka combination. Bloody Russian. That one. Okay. Are we going to 
They're still looking for that signal. I totally did not listen to them. More of nothing? Artyom, the only thing I can hear is that Geiger counter ticking. Game looks pretty good. What the heck is that? Uh, yes, and there's also those damn things. Calling all the time. Let's go home, dear, please. Dear, are we... are we a thing? Don't you think I'd also love to live on an ocean beach or in a green forest? But what good are these fantasies in a silent world? I mean, silent I grew up near the ocean. It's overrated. <clears throat> it's just where dirt meets water. Okay, so let's take our little Geiger counter backpack thing a jig. We took our time. Time to replace our Got filters. a new gun. Oh, swap filter. Move it. We don't need any extra oh, it's like a breathing uh, okay oh, apparatus. Kill me if he finds out I went up with you. Twice if he learns we've been to a Hansa off limit zone. Okay. Whoop. I wonder if there's fall damage. All these ruins? Uh, See am I a silent protagonist? And Moscow had the best anti-air defenses in the country. If this is how it looks now, imagine how the rest of the world. I feel like this game would not have a silent protagonist because you're already like an established There's just person. No way anything can live up here, but the monsters. I like both. I'm. Whoa! Whoa! Look, maybe you should come back to the order. We'll should... move to Polis. Dad says he'll arrange a flat for us. Nice. Because if not us, then who? I'm down. A flat with a kitchen uh. and a shower. Let's go in turns here. Go, 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 go. Enough. Oh, go in turns here. Whoops! I totally did not listen. At least it held. <laughs> Sorry. You kind of well, told me that a little too late, though. The woods. Whoa! Hear that? Flashlight on. Turn the light off. Already did. Oh, turn it off. All right. Well, everybody, that's gonna be an episode. We're about on it. On the next one, we're gonna continue this at least for one more episode, and we'll see what happens. Maybe I'll do more, but I'm not sure. I'm kind of into it so far. But let me know what you think, and I'll catch you next one. Bye, everybody. Bye. Uh, uh. Mm. 